Hey, it's Gavin here. I hope you're well and you can hear me. I'm a little bit late, so I hope you don't mind. I'm just going to get things up and running, and we're going to get going in about two minutes or so, maybe less. So I'm just going to let a few people know that we are on board and we're actually live, and that some people can actually join in, you know, jump in with us, and do this button fire workout that I've got planned for us. So it should be a little treat. So let me get the link. And I will fire it off and see who will uh, hop on board with us. So if you're watching this, make sure you say hello. Let me know where you're from. How's your day? Let's let some light in here, actually. It's a little bit dark. So there we go. The old British weather's not doing as much good today. It's freezing again outside. So there we go. So how's your week been so far? Enjoying yourself? Keeping up with these workouts that I'm putting out there? Maybe you're watching the replay. So if you're watching the replay, make sure you save these videos. Make sure you hit that live notification so that you know when we're going live and you can hop in with us and make sure you do some of these workouts because they're good fun. I promise you, they are good fun. All right, so I'm going to send this off. I'm going to get going. So as I said, button fire today. And let's straighten you up a little bit. You're all over the shop, so we can't have that, can we? There we go, that's better. All right, so are you ready for this? I hope so. There we go. Should do us much nicer. All right, so we've got three exercises in the main workout today. Okay, hip bridge, Bulgarian squats, and a squat and lunge combo. So that should be a whole lot of fun. But first off, we want to get you warmed up. So this is the plan. We're going to do a stance jack. Stance jack look like this with a little hop to the side. Easy peasy. Like so. If you can't do that one, you can do the walkout version. So it's step, step, just like so. But this is what we're looking for. Just 30 seconds. So I'm going to start the timer off here. A rough 30 seconds. Then we're going to go into our second exercise, which is a bit of a sumo squat. So here we go. So dropping it down. Get in the groove. Big smiles. Let's see what we can do with these legs and the old butt. Let's get it ready. So we're going to prime these muscles, get the joints up to scratch. And then get on with the main workout, okay? You with me? If you are, give me a like, say hello, let me know what you're up to. All right, next up, we've got that sumo squat with the leg swipe. So, so what's here in the middle, gonna bring your leg across, step, squat, bring it across. So a little hip opener in there, whip it across. I see someone's dropped me a little comment there. So I'll have a look at that in a second. Can't see from here. Give me a couple more of these, and then we're gonna go back on those stance jacks. So open up those hips really wide, sink down into it. Give me one more, boom. All right, we're gonna go back on those stance jacks. So here we go, reaching down, keep your head up, keep your back straight, I'll show you from the side. This is what we're looking for, we're here. You don't need to reach all the way down to the floor, especially if your back is not very flexible, or maybe your hips are a little bit tight and you can't quite get down there. Those hammies saying, no, 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 you're not going to the floor because what happens is the back gets out of shape and we don't want that. Control the breathing. Looking good so far. Keep with me. One more. All right, so we'll start it low in a squat, bring it across, open up the hips, down, round. Say, so control your breathing in through the nose, out through the mouth. Here we go. It's going to be a good one. I promise you. Get okay, one more of those. Boom. All right, little stretch, grab some water. I'm just gonna hop over here and pull you up a little bit. See Aggie's on, that's what we like. I'll let you know about that, uh, that ab wheel later on. It's not something I actually use the ab wheel, it's good, but I tend to get most of my ab work, planks, bicycles, all those sorts of things. All right, Ooh, keep your balance. 
knees together, push your hips forward, give these a little stretch. If your balance is a little bit shaky, hold on to the wall, piano, whatever you've got at home. And if you're not particularly flexible, it's okay to hop down to the ground, that's absolutely fine. Let's push your hips forward. Bring it down low. One way, over, and we're gonna go one more time, backwards and forwards. All right, let's get things up and rolling. So we're gonna start on the floor of a hip bridge. So line on your back, we've got 60 seconds. This is our primer, okay? So whenever you do any butt work, this is definitely one that you wanna throw in. We're starting now, so. Feet flat if you're a bit of a beginner. Push your hips up, try and squeeze your butt cheeks for all they're worth. Not literally squeeze them, that's just a little bit weird. Dropping it down and up and back. Okay, so trying to really bring them up slowly. Up and down. And you can do one leg if you prefer as well. So you can do 30 seconds one side, 30 seconds the other. Up to you, you can really change it up, a couple of reps each side. It depends where you are. If you really want to dig your heels in, you're going to get a little bit more out of it as well. Push those hips up high, trying to get that straight line through the body, back down. So today is not, not really one of those sort of hit sessions, those high intensity workouts that we do sometimes. So you're not going to be sweating buckets or anything like that, which, uh, which might be good news for you. Gonna give it one more time, drop down, and into our next exercise. So straight up onto your feet. I'm gonna use a little stool here, so you might wanna grab a chair. You can use a sofa at home, anything like that. So Bulgarian squat. Let me pull this back a little bit so you can actually see. So I've got one foot on the top there. I'm gonna hop out slightly, and then I'm gonna sit back into this one. So a common mistake is people just drop straight down. Watch what happens when I do that. The front knee just darts forward. We don't want that to happen. You wanna sit back. So imagine the chair behind you, you're gonna sit back into that chair. Now the back leg's there just for the ride. Coming down here, notice my back position. So it's still straight, but I'm leaning forward slightly. I come up, pushing through the heel. I'm gonna start the timer here. I'm way off the mark on that one. So we're gonna do one minute each side. All right, and once you've got the balance, you know, if your balance is a little bit iffy, hold onto a chair, table, hand on the wall, your partner's face maybe, if you're, you know, if they've been annoying you recently, just bang, have that. All right, so this is what we're looking for. Slow and steady, unless you're a bit more advanced, and then you can really get into a bit more of, of a flow with it, okay? But make sure this back leg is just there for the ride, pushing through the front heel. Notice this front knee doesn't go past my toes, that's what you want to aim for. Looking forward, obviously I'm looking at you, so don't copy that. <sighs> Ideally you've got the, your laptop, your tablet, or phone, whatever in front of you. There we go. So it's just start to feel the legs warming up a touch. <sighs> breathe in on the way down, breathe out on the way up. We've got four seconds left and we're going to switch legs. <sighs> Good job. All right, switch it up, kick it back. Hop out of the touch, get your balance, and when you're ready, let's go. Sink into it, push up. Again, keep an eye on your back position, shoulders back, heads up. There we go. Start slowly, find your rhythm, and then get going. Now, another thing that people often do is don't go low enough on this one, so really sit back into it. Get that butt working, buns of steel. That's what we want. The fire's gonna be doing a little bit of work anyway, but the lower you get, the more this is gonna work for you. Breathe it in, breathe it out. Breathe it in, breathe it out. 15 seconds to go. And then we've got our little combo. Now two ways to do the combo. You can do it a little bit more high impact, a bit more intense or we can do it a little bit more low key. So I'm gonna show you. All right, so this is the version that I'm going to do. I'm gonna do two jump squats, lunge, 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 lunge. So I've got jumping lunges in there, two and four, two and four. Okay, I'll show you again. So it's one, two, and actually you wanna drop straight into it. So one, two, 
three, four, one, two. That's what we're looking for, okay? If you can't do that, then it's absolutely fine. I'll show you what to do. You've got one, two, stay low, lunge back, come forward a bit, lunge, lunge, lunge. So stay low, look how low I am. So one, two, lunge, lunge, okay? So still two and four. That's what we're looking at. All right, are you ready? Let's do this. So hopefully I'm not gonna jump too high and take my head out there. But it's two and four, two and four, you ready? Let's go. So one, two, one, two, three, four. One, two, I'm gonna show you from the side actually. So it's one, two, three, four. One, two, stay low, one, two, three, four. One, two, definitely burning up into those lunges. Three, one, two, one, two, three, four. On those lunges, make sure when you land, don't lean forward. Don't want that front knee going too far forward, okay? So maybe you can do the low key option, stepping back. So low impact version. Sit on the second one, back, lunge, 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 lunge. And back up into those squats. So one, two, one, two, three, and four. There we go. So that's one round done. I see those combos really zap your legs. All right, we're going back to the floor. Straight down. So we go onto the bridge. Enough to get your breath back. Up nice and high, straight leg. Down from the hips to the shoulders, all that straight line, back down. Bring it up, slowly down. Trying to control your breathing, especially if you're doing the more high impact version there that we just did on the squats and lunges. <clears throat> Twenty seconds left. Again, trying to squeeze your butt cheeks. Don't just go through the motions. As you bring it up to the top, really hold tight. Come on, buns of steel. Bring them up. Squeeze, squeeze, squeeze. Back down. Just let your butt kiss the ground. Last one. And down we go. All right. Back on the Bulgarians. So grab your stool, your chair, your sofa. Remember to balance. So. Kick one leg back. I'll give you a moment to get yourself balanced. All right, then we're gonna sit back into it, okay? So remember, pop your hips back, back legs just for the ride, all through that front leg. Come up slowly, control, breathe it out. Looking strong here. Here we go. Not looking too shabby at all. This is what we want. Get that rhythm. Doesn't have to be too quick. Might want to put the timer on. I'll knock off about 15 seconds for you. If any of my old clients are watching this, they'll be like, eh, we never used to keep time. Didn't count reps. That's still the case now. All right, we've got 30 seconds to go. I uh, can't say I'm looking forward to the squat lunge combo. Whew. Sit back into it, back straight. Keep your shoulders back, head up. Stand tall. 15 seconds to go. 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, last one, 2, 1. Woo! All right, shake it out a little bit. Give yourself a moment. Kick it back. Find your balance. Get your rhythm. I'm going to hop out of touch so I've got enough space to actually sit back into this. All right, let's go. We're down, drive through the heel. Make sure you're not pushing through your toes, but through the heel. <sighs> breathe it out, breathe it in, breathe it out. That's what we want. Definitely burning up a little bit now. Hope you're, hope you're managing at home with this. It's gonna get a little bit tasty in this next round. Especially on these lunges and squats we're about to do. 
So if at any point you're struggling on this next set of exercises, give yourself that three second countdown and then hop back to it. Literally hop back to it. So excuse that pun. Eight seconds to go. Come on. Strong legs. Boom, relax. All right, this should be fun. So two and four, two and four. You choose what you wanna do. High impact version or low impact version. All right, so let's do this. I'm gonna start with high. So it's get some height, dropping down low. One, two, three, four, one, two. Stay low, one, two, three, four. For those of you doing the low impact version. So it's one, two, stay low, one, balance it, two, three. Again, you can hold on to something if you need to. Squat again, one, two, back down, one. Legs are definitely getting fried. Stay low, and then back. Let's go, shake it out if you need to. My legs are burning up as well, don't worry about it. One, two, lunge, one. Step it back, making sure as you step back, again, the front knee doesn't lean too far forward. There we go. Just finish it with a hop. All right, we've got one more round. I'm gonna give you a little bit of time there. Shake those legs out. Here we got Dorothy, hope you're well. Camilla, hope you're well as well. A little recommendation from your friends. So hopping in, hopefully, doing this routine with us. Let's come down. And by the way, if you're just tuning in, and those comments might be in the way, you can swipe them out the way, especially as I'm lying down. Remember, swipe to the side if you need to. All right, so let's go. One more time, here we go. Bring it up, let them drop. Kiss the ground, straight back up. Don't go through the motion, squeeze those butt cheeks. Up it comes, squeeze, 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 squeeze. Back down. <clears throat> Here we go. Should be a little bit of leg trembling going on, I imagine. A little bit of lactic acid sitting in these thighs. <clears throat> so time to grit the teeth. Try and push through it that little bit. And remember what I said earlier. If you are struggling at any point, give yourself those few seconds. It's okay, a little sip of water and then jump back in. That's absolutely fine. But do try and push yourself. Give it your best effort. <clears throat> 10 seconds to go. I'm actually looking forward to the Bulgarian squats here. Three, two, and one. Back down. All right, up to our feet. Let's go. Shake it out a little bit. Bulgarian squats. So grab your stool chair, partner's face if you need balance. Here we go. Foot up on top. All right, sit back into it. Get that balance. Sink, push through that heel on that front leg. There we go. Need a strong finish now. <sighs> give me some likes, give me some love if you're enjoying this. <laughs> Even a few hate faces, I don't mind. Maybe it's really burning and you're struggling. You think, wow, Gavin, I'm not, not down with this. I don't mind that. Come on, big effort. 20 seconds left. Mm. Strong legs, strong legs all the way. We've got this. 10 seconds to go. Four, three, two, one. Boom. Shake it out. Here we go, other side. All right. Set it up. Sit back. Here we go, time is on. Shoulders back, head looking forward. <sighs> Try and get that butt down low. So sit back into it. That's where the work is as you push through here. <sighs> All right. Remember what I said earlier about not really getting a sweat on? Well, I don't know about you, but I'm getting a bit of a sweat on. <clears throat> We've got just over 20 seconds to go. Come on. Don't try and stand too long at the top. As soon as you hit the top, moment pause. 
straight back down. Come on. Here we go. 10 seconds. Mm -mm. Strong. Five, four, three, two, and one. All right, shake it out. Here we go. Ah, dreading these ones now. Absolutely dreading these. Let's do it together though. All right, time is on. Two and four. Here we go. One, two, one, two, three, four. One, two, one, two, three, four. One, two. Ooh, yeah. Get back into it, Walsh. One, two, three, four. One, two. Barely getting off the ground that. Come on. Keep pushing. 30 seconds to go. One, two, three, four. Come on, legs. Come on. One, two. I'm struggling as well. Here we go. One, two. Eight seconds left. Here we go. Finish it. Two, three, four. Still a few seconds. Get some squats in. Wow. Okay, so proper jelly legs there, especially on those last two squats. Deep breaths. Well done if you've just done that with me. I'm going to hop over here and have a look what's going on. <laughs> I think you're right. I'm trying to push a little bit too much there. Sometimes that little bit slower. Keep it going. I was trying to get some height. And towards the end there, there was no height in there. All right. What we're going to do, just a little jog on the spot. Try and flush some of that lactic acid out in the legs. So, easy jog. Nice and steady. Here we go. So, I hope you like that one. That combo, that squat lunge combo. That's a tough one after you've already done the bridge and the Bulgarian squats. Certainly felt that, as you can probably tell when I, when I was doing that one. All right, a few more seconds. I'm going to start to stretch it out. There we go. Legs are feeling better. Not too mashed. There we go. Shake it out. So deep breaths in through the nose, out through the mouth. Breathe it out. All right, let's take it down low. Legs wide, pushing the heels into the ground. Push your butt back. Now legs might be trembling a little bit here. Here we go. Push those heels down, lift your butt up high. Reaching down towards the floor as well. Just don't need to bend your back so much. It's all about pushing those heels down, lifting your butt high. Okay, take it to the side. There we go, hold this position. Stretching out the inner five, you can go lower to the ground. Some people are happy dropping here. That's absolutely fine. Depends where you're at with your flexibility. There we go. So I hope you enjoyed that one. If you've not given me a like or share yet, make sure you do so at the end of this routine. Say hello as well. Let me know what you thought of that one. So pushing the hips forward here, stretching that hip flexor. Good, reach it up. Couple more seconds. Turn it round. Again, drop it. No surprise if your legs are all over the shop at the moment. <laughs> Pushing those hips forward, reaching up. If you need to hold onto the wall or a chair, that's absolutely fine. Go for it. By now, if you've been following these routines, you should know that you can do that and you don't have to copy me exactly. You can find that easier option. Even if you, even if I don't say an exercise that might be more suited to you, you can do it. You don't have to copy me and absolutely ruin your body, okay? <laughs> it depends where you are. Lots of people doing these routines live and on a replay. And I also download them and stick them on YouTube and things like that. So it depends where you're at. All right. Kick one leg up. Knees together, hips forward. You can lie down as well if you want to do it on the floor. Up. 
other side. There we go. Shake it out. Now, if you need to, as always, a little bit more stretching is not going to hurt. And if you've got a foam roller at home, hop on the roller. Really try and ease out any knots you might have, especially tomorrow after doing that one. But I hope you enjoyed that one. And speaking of tomorrow, I'm going to be here same time doing a little ab workout. And I might even throw in a couple of exercises just to treat you. Okay. So thank you for watching and I'll see you tomorrow. Bye for now.